All right, guys, so the third knot uh, in the series that I like to use in my boat on a daily basis is the Albright. I use it uh, when I don't have a loop system from my backing to my fly line. I use it a lot in my GT rigs um, for shock tippets. So what we're gonna do today is I've got uh, a 20 pound Cortland tapered leader and I'm gonna add some 40 pound shock tippet. Uh, so what we need to do is we basically take the 40 pound shock tippet and we just double it over and we make a little loop just like that. I like to pinch it so it's nice and clean. I take the tag end of my leader, this happens to be a 12 foot, 20 pound leader, and I'm basically gonna slide it from in behind, and I'm gonna leave about four or five inches, right like that. So it's going through the loop from the backside, and I'm just gonna pinch that off. All right, basically what I do now is I'm gonna wrap the tapered leader, the 20 pound, back over itself and then back through the knot here, the eyelet. And usually you need seven, eight turns. So there's one, keep the knot twisted, two, three, four, five, six, seven, you like to keep it pinched between your fingers. So as you can see, you still have the loop right here. And then I'm gonna pass the tag end of the 20 pound leader back through the top the same way that it came through in the beginning. Uh, right through there. So basically the standing part and the tag end both come out the same side. I'm just gonna pull them both together, tight and slow. Lubricate and just pull snug. And there you have it, the Albright knot. Great for shock tippet, great for fly line backing to fly line if you don't have a loop knot. Just a great knot when you have a thin diameter line to a thicker diameter line.